Hi, I'm Jonathan Thurston, Suncorp ambassador and former rugby league player. Today I'm on location with the Queensland SES to learn a bit more about how they can help you get through storm season safely. Hey, Mo. Hey, JT. How are you, buddy? Yeah, very well, thanks. Uh, you wouldn't be any good at hide and seek in that uniform, eh? No, no, we don't uh, hide very well, <laughs> mate, that's for sure. I guess that's why they call you guys the Orange Army. Orange Army, they call us, and uh, uh, Orange Angels as well. Where's that accent from? Ah, uh, New Zealand. New Zealand? Yeah. I'm a Kiwi too. Oh, yeah? My dad's a Kiwi as well. Yeah, right, that's yeah, awesome. nice. So what made you want to be a volunteer? Uh, going through the Croce earthquakes back home and not having anyone there to support us when we needed it. And uh, so we come over to Brizzy here for, just for a change and couldn't get to work when the floods happened. So uh, I looked on TV and seen the guys in orange dancing around and I thought, you know, it's something I want to do. So I uh, applied to it and here I am now, so. I'm sure you've had some big rescues in your seven years. What's the most memorable one? Probably the one that sits at the top is uh, when Cyclone Debbie comes through, uh, we had a boat that uh, broke free from its mooring uh, on the Logan River and we had to go and uh, secure it back to a tree uh, on the land to, so it wouldn't go down and smash through a uh, railway line. Well, that's pretty intense. It was intense, it sure was, <laughs> yes. I know Suncorp provide funding towards the SES to help uh, the community during storm season. What type of things do you do from that? Uh, that funding helps us to, uh, to be able to get out in the community before a storm event to get our uh, information out there to them. Uh, it also helps us to provide the, the right uh, equipment that we need to get out to, to do our job safely. And if you had a little bit of advice for people out there, how can they prepare for storm season? Probably uh, look out for your neighbour, you know, um, help your community, you know, help those around you first and, uh, you know, if you, if you do need us, we're there. I know there might be some people out there that would be reluctant to call the SES. When exactly should they call the SES? People shouldn't feel bad about calling us, you know, we are, are there for the community, so if they, they feel that they are in danger from a storm um, or any other event that, that's happened, you know, they can call us uh, on the 132500 number. There's an app for the mobile as well that they can download and get hold of us that way. Well, I think the SES are awesome. Um, you are the true heroes of the community. Is there anything you can teach me here today? Well, there are a few things. We can, uh, I can teach you some knots. They're a big part of what we do um, uh, in our day-to-day -day stuff. The only knot I know how to tie is my shoelaces, so <laughs> I think we should get started. I think we should, mate. Should we go now? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go, buddy. I think my knot tying skills now, mate. Any good? <laughs> mate. <laughs> Come on, Damo, mate. Please. I want to go home. Let me out. <laughs> 